Welcome everyone to another TensorFlow object detection tutorial. So in previous tutorial we learned how to get actual detection. Our example was the cars and but we could use that for example for cars, birds, humans, dogs, cats, anything we want. Well there was a lot of these classes but okay our detection was really slow so in this tutorial I'm going to focus on cl cleaning up the messy code all the commented code and so on and I will try to make this to work quite fast so that we could move forward with getting our own custom data to to detect objects so let's open well no let's copy our previous code from previous tutorial and I'll rename it, I'll call it grab screen pretty. So in let's open it. Now we'll go all through this code and clean the comments we don't need. And then I will try to implement make some code modifications to make it work better for us we don't need this also I think okay so this we are leaving as it was We can copy this to another utility imports and we can I think we can delete all of this. Okay. So next we are doing model preparation. Okay, we don't need this. Name we are not using name actually because we're not downloading a model so delete 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 okay leave leave this we're not downloading model so we'll delete this yes we are loading frozen model into memory so starting fine loading label map we are doing it here so we can delete this part of code I think okay detection detection run inference for single image detection okay okay so we're working with this code here and give me a second So this code slows us down, so we mostly need to modify this part, so I delete these lines which we don't need and I can add a comment that here we 
show image with detection right now. And below we simply calculate we calculate our frames per second. Now we need to okay I'll modify this as a different way. I'll copy this code, this definite function, uh, some parts of it to our while true code. So you just need to copy it from me and and everything will be fine. I'll begin from the top. Here need to be get real color we do this okay we don't need this anymore yes we need to expand dimensions <clears throat> actual detection output dictionary we won't use that function anymore so we delete that and We'll use a little different way this so all right image tensor equal to detection graph and here get tensor by name and here I'll write simple image tensor equal to zero and we use similar functions for boxes scores classes let me just show, write it to you boxes then we go with scores then we go with classes And after this, we add a line num detections that it's equal to detection graph the same. Get tensor by name. Okay. Well, I will just need to copy. Okay, now we need to add another line of code so I'll uh, write it or copy better to copy maybe scores then goes classes and go num num detection equal to ses session run and here we Use the same array and here we feed dictionary equal to image tensor equal image numpy expanded. Okay, and we close the function here. We can add some more gaps here. And now we need to fix this. So we leave as it is. Here we delete. Don't need this line anymore. We'll use lines th thickness with three. It goes with true category index. Okay, and now I'll add numpy squeeze boxes, and I'll copy this. The final will be scores, and here is 
glasses. Glasses and oh, here's okay. Everything is fine here, and here we as use it as type numpy int thirty two. And next, we use image show, same as before. Yeah. Okay. Pretty. So, I think we can remove this, and we don't need this function anymore. So, detection function. We remove this, we can write it like. Now here is our detection implemented inside our while loop. We delete the last line. And as you can see the code is much much shorter. We save it. And of course we can try to run it. Let's see if we don't have any errors. <clears throat> Okay, we have something here. Boxy. Where is our box? Here it is. We try to run it again. So it was a small error, so I think what's now light and thickness? Let's go. Let's see what's wrong with it. Boxes. That's strange. Let me see what I can find here. So, image numpy, okay, numpy squeeze boxes, glasses, test type, scores, category index. Actually, then I can't find an error. So, <sighs> give me more time. I'll stop the video for a short moment. I'll try to find what's the what's wrong with it. Oh, I see what's wrong. So, I'll need to fix this. I forgot to change these. I just copied them. So. Here is scores, here is classes, and last is detection. Detections. So, I hope this was an error. So, let's see. Build and run. One more error. Image boxes doesn't exist. Yeah, they doesn't exist because it is detection boxes. 
sorry sorry for my another mistake and yeah and here is num detection yeah build and let's see if it was actually the problems yeah as you can see everything's working and fps is much higher than before if you remember what it was before so it was much lower than zero and now we can try to open our browser and let's check what results we get with our detection so let's see about maybe cars images car yeah as you can see it's it's detecting these cars we can try to write a bus for example bus it's not that good with buses but well it's detected and what else we can try something like bicycles bicycle yeah the percent of bicycle it's much higher than bus well for orange I said what else we can so cat teddy bear <laughs> that's funny who thought about that that's interesting terrible and sweet cats so as you can see our detection works much faster now I think it's over for this tutorial. Our code is pretty. I will upload it for to my website and to our, my GitHub repository. So you can simply download it and try it on yourself. And I think that's it. If you have any questions, be sure to leave them in the comment section below this video. If you liked my video, you know what to do. Smash up the likes button and subscribe my channel. Then you will get more of my videos text version well as i said will be uploaded thank you all for watching good luck and see you in the next tensorflow object detection video see ya